welcome to an unboxing video, because today something really special arrived in the mail. Um, this really big box sent to me. Oh, now everyone knows where I live. She's alright. Um, this box is the limited edition Space Marine Codex. That's just come out. Um, it cost me £100 and I'm really excited for it. Um, in the mail as well some more stuff came out. My sleeves for Magic the Cavern came out but no one cares about that. Everyone wants to see the good stuff. <laughs> Let's try not to kill ourselves. Oh. This this box, like this is the first time I actually receive a whole box from the mail, like ever. There we go, there's some official paper in there saying that I bought the thing. And that I paid £100 for it. Thank you. Oh! It looks fancy. Thank you, piece of paper. So, what do you get inside the box? Well, you get a box, apparently. This box is boxy looking. These boxes are cool. I might keep it. Might use it for something. So this is what you get already. 19th Legion, Raven Guard, with the Raven Guard symbol on the back. I really hope you can see it because it's beautiful. It's really nice to touch. Now there are two slot things. One of them has a little pulley thing, the other one doesn't, because it's the book. Hopefully I'll be able to get it out without damaging it, because that would be awesome. I think I'm going to take out the pulley thing first. Oh wow. This is going to be interesting. I believe that these guys have spray painted it. No, they're... Oh my god. Really, Games Workshop? Okay, so they've made... They've made the cover of this in some weird, like, foamy plastic, which, due to the pressure of, like, being travelled and stuff, is in fact stuck. Not, not completely, but mostly to the box. It's, like, made out of some kind of plastic thing. Game Shop shops, like, have some really intelligent ideas sometimes. And this definitely was one of them. Oh my god. I'm actually damaging the box now. Jesus Christ. It looks fancy. Oh, thank God I edit these videos. Okay, after much struggling and using... The way I opened it was by using a knife to sort of prop both ends. Um, I managed to open it. It's much easier to open now, but it's still fucking hassless. Oh, Jesus. Makes a really funny noise as well. So this is on the little shelf. As you can see, I have damaged it because the material is really nice. I'll give them that. And it was probably worth £100. But really, just next time, do it properly. Oh, hello. So, what do we get in the limited edition pack? Well, you get so many sexy things. We get a book uh, called the Adeptus Astartes Successor Chapters. And inside is a lot of printed pieces of paper with every single armor of every single successor chapter. Which is like, you know, mighty fancy. If you don't know what army to paint, this is an amazing book, I guess. Um, this is like really sexy. You get, also, these are pieces of paper, well a card actually, with an armor on the front, a type of space marine armour, and then a whole description about each piece of armour. It's really good. Like, if you don't know what the hell Mark III is, for example, which is heresy, just look there, Mark III, and then you just read all about it. Actually, Mark III is iron armour, Mark IV is heresy. No, Mark V is heresy. I, I don't know my armour, so now I do! <laughs> you also get, and I think these are the best parts, Objective counters numbered 1 to 6. I'm going to just show you. Oh, they feel so nice in my hand. So this is magic. Objective marker 1. It's got a 1 on it. Okay. And on the back, you have a Space Marine helmet. I'm going to be using these down club. Because um, they are absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And then, here... We have a deck of the Space Ring Tactical Objective um, cards. So you'll be able to 
go through all the go through all the objectives really easily by the way and then there's like the special space marines one so as you can see 12 is honor the chapter rather than capture objective 2 um, so that's a bunch of fun I'm just gonna put this back in that's all the extra fancy bits that you get I'm gonna put these like that I, you probably can't even see them um, with a damaged box now because bloody hell so now is the fun time of trying to get this out oh well that was easy and here it is my limited edition Raven Guard Codex of which mine is number 81 out to 400 um, which makes me really happy of course this is 81 out of 400 in the UK they did make more in different languages um, but oh it's got basically on the front it has the same picture or as here which is basically the space marines you can't see because it's darkened because I'm playing Raven Guard and that's just what we are you just got a bunch of Raven Guards you got their um, lovely little helmets and all that they got their eyes that are slightly glowing and on the back you have it written 19 um, across the vastness of space Alien races plot to the dethroning of the Emperor and the downfall of humanity. This is the Imperium's call to arms and nothing shall stand in the way of the Righteous Crusade. So that's that's written there. Then you've got a nice little Raven Guard symbol with what number codex edition this is. All the pages are black. As in, not they're not just printed black, but they've got black um, sides. Just to fit within the whole Raven Guard aspect. aspect. Um, one thing that I forgot to mention. You have a Raven Guard shield up here. You have it written Raven Guard there, and then you have the Legion, obviously. So that's really cool. I'm really looking forward to just showing this off around club. And then you open the first page, and you just have the normal Space Marines Codex, which I'd like to add is a bolstering 200 pages. That is huge. And this much of it is backstory. Where is it? Right, I'm going to count backstory and painting together, because they seem to be together. Oh, we've got some pages stuck together, that's not cool. Oh my, Jesus. All of this, all the first from page, like, 4, all the way to page 111, is backstory, and then the rest of it is, like, extra stuff, which you don't really need. I mean, that's why you buy a codex, right? Um, <laughs> so there we go. That along with like all these lovely things I'm trying to like, not die here open up slightly, there we go that is the Raven Guard limited edition pack I'm hoping that you can see that, I'm actually going to go behind the camera now to uh, make sure you can see everything that's on the table which I think is nothing Whoa! there we go that is the Raven Guard limited edition pack six objective markers a book about all the successor chapters and all their varying colour schemes. Eight armour cards with all the types of armour, the marks of armour and their uh, history. Tactical objective cards. The codex, which looks magnificent. The box it came in, which is really good to put your codex, really shit to put your tactical objective markers. <laughs> What, number one to six, really, really nice quality. So there we go. I'm very happy with my purchase, apart from the fact that I had to damage this box because this box was a bit too grippy. Um, didn't want to let it go, obviously. But the box itself is really nice. I don't know if I've given you a close-up. I think I have. On the top, you've got another uh, 90, and then on the bottom, you've got nothing. But anyway, yeah, thank you very much for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. That is the limited edition Space Marine Raven Guard uh, Codex and other stuff. Um, I'm. <laughs> this is the first time I get some limited edition. I'm really happy. Uh, also, my first ever unboxing video. So I hope it wasn't too shit. I will edit out all the crappy bits. Um, so okay, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.